Hey, well, mm? and makeup. Want makeup? Mm. Hello there, people. Good morning. I hope everybody is doing fine. And I hope you're busy taking care of yourself in these really difficult times that we are experiencing in the world. Today, I'm going to share with you guys my morning routine during this quarantine period. I have been in self-quarantine for two weeks since I came back to Germany from Kenya. Just in case you're wondering who is that tiny little person moving next to me, that is, that is my three-year-old. She woke up in the middle of the night at 3 a.m. to use the washroom and then refused to go back to her room to her bed. So she joined me and it was okay because um, Jay was at home anyway. So I let her just stay with me and cuddle with me. I am definitely not the kind of people who wake up by the first alarm ring. So I stay in bed uh, for a bit. Think about my day, think about uh, the blessings of a good day, a new day, and then check my phone, drink some water, you know, just take it easy. You guys, I am not a morning person, let me just say that. But this is around 6.30 in the morning and definitely way too early for Jazzy to be waking up. So I take her back in my arms and rock her back to bed. Luckily, she's still tired and accepts to sleep again. If she doesn't do this, then she's going to get fussy before lunchtime. Look at my face, so swollen. Nowadays I have such a swollen face. I'm in my third trimester, you guys. So yeah, so I open my windows because especially when I see the sun is outside, I want to feel that on my skin, on my face, and the fresh air. It's just amazing. Spring is here. On this particular day, I had an appointment at 12, so I decided I'm not going to shower just yet. So I just go to the bathroom, wash my, uh, brush my teeth, and then, you know, uh, wash my face and do my skincare a little bit, just a little bit, because I'm going to do it once again when I went, when I go to into the shower. So this is how I clean my face in the morning. I don't do that much in the morning because I usually take my nighttime skincare routine very seriously. So these are the products that I use for my morning skincare routine at the moment. So after that, I head over to the living room. Sometimes it's still a bit rough from the night before you know so I put the couch back in order and just in case I didn't manage to, to do that the night before I open the door again for fresh air I'm just getting the table ready outside because that's where I want us to have breakfast today just so you know we didn't have breakfast outside it was still a bit cool for that so I go into the kitchen and boil some water for tea and coffee. I love to leave my kitchen clean from the night before so I don't have a lot of stress in the morning. So I take away all the clean dishes, put them away and then I empty my dishwasher so that I have a space for my breakfast dishes after breakfast. So I quickly do that and then start preparing my breakfast let me say though that i feel really really lucky that jay is more of a morning person than i am so we complete each other that way as well so for my breakfast i have been really loving my oatmeal breakfast which i usually um sweetened with fruits so that's uh, the oats that's um two bananas a half a mango some strawberries so i add a pinch of salt to my water and i add my oats in the water and let that cook for a little bit and then i blend my fruits together and after that i warm the fruit smoothie so to say 
into my oats and that's done it's so it's so simple yet so healthy really happy that my family my two loved ones love this kind of breakfast as well so i don't have to prepare um, many dishes in the morning so yeah sometimes you have this and that's more than enough it keeps you satisfied for longer just a tip you guys this is how i clean my smoothie bottle i just add water and soap and then i blend that again and when you blend it cleans your jar so well that you don't need much cleaning after that so yeah this is me preparing coffee for jay and kenyan tea for me and like i said i have an appointment so this tea is going to be sugarless i'm going to the gyna today to check my sugar tolerance levels so by now Jay is already back home and is already doing his exercise. He didn't need to go to sleep because he slept most of the night. He was on call duty at work. So he sits down with me after and we have breakfast. By this time Jasmine is still asleep. So I ended up eating bread because I'm not allowed to take sugar. Remember there are fruits in the oatmeal breakfast that I had prepared. So I ended up taking bread instead of the oatmeal i have a little chat with jay about his work in the night sometimes i really like to know what he what's going on there because it's a risky job uh, and sometimes i really don't want to know after we've all had breakfast i go ahead and spread the beds you know I'm really happy when uh, Jay is around in the mornings. I, I sit, I told you guys I'm not a morning person. So when he's around, at least he can take care of, you know, Jazzy as I do some stuff or rest sometimes. I wake up feeling tired nowadays. I go to sleep feeling very tired because I am doing so much around the house. Mm -hmm. Then I choose the clothes that the little one is going to wear and by this time the daddy is giving her her bath and then I head to my room to get ready as well, choose my clothes and then take a shower afterwards and yeah just simply get ready for the day. after i'm done dressing i go ahead and do my makeup so that is my spf cream that i have been using actually sometimes instead of a primer and it is actually super awesome so i'm going for a just a very simple day makeup look this is only because i'm having an appointment later otherwise i would really not bother to do this much i would just apply my skincare and some lippy and just stay in the house like that hi hi baby papa and now we Nope, mothers don't always get time to do makeup in peace. I want makeup. Hey, oh my god. Hey, well, mm? I want makeup. You want makeup? Mm. This is kind of, hmm. I don't even know what to tell you, just. I'll give you a lip balm. Mm. I'll do your lippy, okay? Okay. 
Come here. Tote bag. Now she's touching my face and needs to whisper in my ears now. But once you get kids, you don't know how to live without them. That's just love. And don't wait. Come I like to have conversations, phone calls with my friends when I'm doing my makeup, at least some, then I have some time, you know. After that, I just go to the couch and relax while editing videos as I wait for the time to go for my appointment. And this is us heading to the appointment. And when we go back to the house, it's lunchtime and nap time. Thanks guys for watching. Bye.